to a show It dropped me off at Grandpa Joe's I kicked and screamed, so please don't know Grandma, take me home 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 I had to eat my dinner So it's Monday morning, start of a new week, just had a few things to deal with in the morning, my, my daughter's having some issues at school so we had to go down and meet the teacher, so it's a bit late getting going today. Uh, today's kind of an off day for me, rest day, 40 minute intervals on the treadmill. I haven't done intervals for 8 weeks because of my ankle injury, my ankle is feeling pretty good so I tried it out today, nothing uh, extreme. Uh, eight minutes mile pace, two minutes on, two minutes off. I did 30 minutes of those intervals. Five minute easy warm up. Now I'm doing a five minute cool down. This week, aiming towards Thursday, eight hours on the bike and a 45 minute run. And Friday, three and a half hour run. And uh, 3,000 yards in the pool. But plus I think I got 150 kilometers on the bike on Wednesday. So today, tomorrow, pretty, tomorrow, I uh, run, easy run 45 minutes and then 4,000 yards, the 10 by 400 set. So I'm pretty much set up for the week. The ankle feels fantastic, uh, but having said that, whenever I have a problem with it, it's always a couple of hours after the exercise is finished. In terms of intervals, I'm not doing anything crazy. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do my interval session each Monday, but I'm gonna ease back into it. That, that was eight minutes, eight minute miles. I think my interval pace is about five and a half minute miles when I'm fit so it's just getting the muscles used to it but for the rest of today I've just been tossing shit in my wardrobe for about nine months so I'm gonna go through my wardrobe clean everything out try and give a whole ton to charity and then I've got to go in the basement because I finally sorted some comics I've got two long boxes I'm gonna find some storage for so it's a maintenance day today but for now I really enjoyed running faster after all the slow running and so I'm just gonna relax, take a shower and get into the household chores. So it's Thursday morning, I'm, I'm just back from the pool. I did a, a ten, pretty good 10 by 400 set, alternating paddles every second set, 30 second rest in between. Sometimes I do 40 second rest if if there's somebody in the lane with me because I gotta share a lane. I don't, I don't wanna be a dick and go off at the same time as them. So I go off and 10 seconds later. Just got home uh, making coffee and I had a protein shake. I uh, also had half a bagel with cream cheese, uh, these awesome bagels here, they come from Trader Joe's pumpkin bagels, I had, I had half because this guy here keeps following me around, he loves bagels, it's his favourite food, he thinks I've got more, I show my hands, I don't, I don't have any, but uh, I make a bagel, he has half, I have half, you look at him, he's going crazy, uh, I'm going to quickly go to the grocery store and then I've got to come back, do a 45 minute uh, easy run, then I should be done by about, and I'll have some lunch at about one o'clock, then I've got nothing to do for two hours. I was going to watch um, some TV, but I've got a lot of writing this week. I don't want to sort of watch shows that I could be watching on the bike, so I don't know what I'm going to do for the afternoon. So it's uh, Thursday today, what I call loading day, basically to load up the legs, get them tired, ready for the longer ride tomorrow. Uh, based on my training plan, it's not, it's not a super 
super long day tomorrow, six hours on the bike. One hour of that will be the time trial, so hard for an hour, then easier five, followed by a run. Uh, we're right here, so I've got 80 kilometers on the bike. Yeah, so it's a three hour and 15 run with the swim on Friday, six hours on the bike and a 45 run tomorrow. So today I've got the swim and the bike. Problem is, uh, it's zero degrees. I was just out walking the dog before, it's pretty cold. Uh, getting my nutrition ready. I uh, bought a new box of this. Actually, as you can see, Costco had a sale on Stroop waffles, so I loaded up on Stroop waffle. It's like this box that has 40 in them, it was only seven bucks 50. I uh, put a little bit of um, goo in here and uh, two bottles, 80 kilometers on the bike. I'm not gonna go super fast, probably take me two and a half hours. And then uh, I'm hoping to have it done before 12 so I can get down the pool 3,000 yards. It's not gonna be a fun bike ride in this cold, but today I'm just gonna catch up on some YouTube videos. Hey, to fill in the time, I'm just watching this guy called CJ Media, C-J-A-Y-E. Uh, it's bizarre that this guy is really similar to me, except for obviously he's far more athletic, but he has two daughters as well. He records his daily life. Uh, he just he was showing us around the house and his kids have got the same bunk beds as my kids, the same blinds. I'm like, is this, this is bizarre, he's on the west coast. But I like to follow his day-to-day -day activities. I've got about two hours to go, a bit over two hours on here. Averaging over 30 kilometers. Had a bit of a workout this morning because I took my kids to school. My youngest wanted to go early because they offer free breakfast. You wanted to see what the breakfast was. So I dropped them, then they forgot to tell me it's a bake sale day. So I had to run home to get cash and run it back. Then run back home again to get on the bike in time. And so I'm just going to catch up on all the CJ Media stuff today and find a documentary on Netflix if I've got time. So I just finished my two and a half hours for 80 kilometers lunchtime now. I just got these burgers left over from last night. As you can see, they're quite small compared to the size of my hand. Brioche buns. I put Wisconsin blue cheddar on here. Some relish and some onion. I got these the burger that's left over from last night. I got two of them there. And I'm just gonna put a fried egg on there. Something's burning. I think it's the egg on the side. Uh, and that'll be my lunch along with a protein shake. Only one will have an egg because I'm too lazy to the fry pan's too small and I'm too lazy to cook a second one. Don't wanna wait that long. And I'll put a slice of cheese on as well. Then I'm heading down the pool for uh, three thousand yards and then it's time to come back and do the school pickup. So I'm going to pick my daughter up. It's uh, 4.30 or 4.45. Bring the dog. She's got a run, run club. Um, and then my day's done. I just went quickly ran to the supermarket and got, did the Ari Clow and got the fried chicken and some salads. Because uh, I can't be asked cooking anything after the long day of training. Uh, because I, I stripped all the beds and washed the sheets. I don't trust anybody washing my stuff. So I wash everything by myself because the cleaner is coming today so I get the cleaner to make the beds. But for like the third or fourth time in about the last three or four weeks, cancelled and called sick. So now I've got to go home and make the beds myself. I still have to run back down to uh, the opposite direction to pick my daughter up from music theatre. Uh, that's in about half an hour. And then I can kind of relax. So I bring the dog now so that I don't have to go out again. I received a pretty cool package um, when, when my wife and I first started dating, like 23, almost 23 years ago. We used to give each other gifts all the time, and for I think it was like a six-month anniversary, she got me this Schaefer pen, and I've kept it with this all this time. It's my writing instrument. For whenever I write, I use it. Managed to find some third-party refills, so that was pretty cool. Uh, so I can keep using that pen. Because when I got it, I bought like about 10 refills and they finally ran out. And then uh, I managed to find a third party seller that, uh, that has them online. So I picked those up. So the rest of the night I'm watching this uh, show on Netflix called Bodies. It looks really cool. It's a DC comic that's converted into a show. I watched one episode, it's really good, so I'm going to relax. Because I've got my long 8 hour ride tomorrow, so load up for carbs tonight.